Hello everyone! I'm Teacher Newton and this is the Melhore Seu Inglês Podcast, o seu podcast de dicas de inglês! Hello everyone! In this week's episode, we're going to take a look at expressions using by. We use by in many expressions to say how we do something. For example, you can send something by post, contact somebody by phone, or by email, or by fax, do something by hand, pay by check, by credit card. Can I pay by credit card? Oh, you can contact me by phone, by fax, or by email. But we say pay cash or pay in cash, not by cash. We also say by mistake, by accident, by chance. For example, we hadn't arranged to meet. We met by chance. But we say do something on purpose, which is the same as you meant to do it. For example, I didn't do it on purpose. It was an accident. Note that we say by chance, by check, etc., not by the chance or by a check. In these expressions, we use by plus noun without the or a. It is the same way we use by to say how somebody travels. For example, by car, by train, by plane, by boat by ship, by bus, by bike, etc., by road, by rail, by air, by sea, by underground. For example, Joanne usually goes to work by bus. Do you prefer to travel by air or by train? But we say on foot. Did you come here by car or on foot? You cannot use by if you say my car, the train, a taxi, etc. We use by plus noun without a, the, or my, etc. For example, we say by car, but in my car, not by my car. By train, but on the train, not by the train. We use in for cars and taxis. They didn't come in their car. They came in a taxi. We use on for bicycles and public transport, buses, trains, etc. We traveled on the train on the 645 train. We say that something is done by somebody or by something. This isn't a passive voice. For example, have you ever been bitten, bitten by a dog? The program was watched by millions of people. Compare by and with. The door must have been opened with a key, not by a key. Somebody used a key to open it. The door must have been opened by somebody with a key. We say a play by Shakespeare, a painting by Rembrandt, a novel by Tolstoy, etc. Have you read anything by Ernest Hemingway? By also means beside. For example, come and sit by me is the same as beside me. Where is the light switch? By the door. Note the following use of by. For example, Claire's salary has just gone up from 2,000 pounds a month to 2,200 pounds a month. So, it has increased by 200 pounds or it has increased by 10%. Cole and Mike had a race over 200 meters. Carl won by about 3 meters and that's this week's episode and this was the melhor e seu inglês of this week e se você quiser falar inglês em tempo recorde entre em contato com a gente 
aulas individuais e personalizadas no Skype ou WhatsApp. Mande uma mensagem para Erika de Padua, Erika com K, arroba gmail.com ou no WhatsApp 31 99223 31 992235540 e faça uma aula experimental gratuita para dicas de inglês, exercícios e muita coisa legal para você aprender inglês sozinho. Procure por Melhore Seu Inglês no Instagram, Facebook e YouTube e visite o nosso site melhoreseuinglês.wordpress.com Keep improving your English and see you on the next episode of Melhores Seu Inglês!